Hi, this is Kelly Ann Jordan bringing you a fun sock shark project. You are going to need to print out the template provided. You're going to need an adult size sock, some white felt, some embroidery thread, um, some thread in colours to match your sock. I'm using some wonder clips, some pins, and uh, a sewing needle. Turn your sock inside out and position your templates and cut out. Now stitch around your pieces, leaving 1 8 of an inch seam allowance. Turn through. On your felt piece, zigzag the stitch cross for your teeth. Now stuff your pieces with toy stuffing. Open out the shark's body and position the top and bottom fins with raw edges matching and with the right sides of your fabric together. This will sandwich the fins and then pin into place. Stitch around the body and leave a gap where the tail will be attached. Turn your shark through this opening and stuff with your toy stuffing. Now attach your tail to the body using a ladder stitch or a slip stitch. Sew until you have completely gone the whole way around the tail using this stitch. When you come to the end of your stitches, fasten by doing a small knot at the end of your stitches and then put your needle through where the knot lies and pull it through the body of the shark. This is to hide your thread, pull tight and snip off the end and it will hide inside the body of the shark. Position and pin into place your side fins to the body of your shark. Now sew around the open edge of the side of the fins using the ladder stitch again. Position and pin into place your teeth and then stitch along the edge of your teeth the whole way around to attach it to your body of your shark. Now it's time to stitch your eyes. I have already pre-stitched a couple of stitches as a guide to know where to bring my needle through. I'm using embroidery thread and I have tucked it behind the teeth so the knot is not seen. Where I have placed my guide knot I will pull through and do a French knot. I will wrap five times around to create my French knot. Do be careful as it can come unraveled as you pull it through. Secure, go back underneath the knot and come out underneath the teeth. Create a small knot, pull tight and cut off so the knot is hidden underneath the teeth. Thanks for watching, hope you've enjoyed this project.